What's up, YouTube? This is x 44 and welcome to Let's Play Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Uh, yeah, I decided to do this one. <laughs> Since Sonic 4 is coming out, well, it got delayed and stuff, um, I just said, why not do Sonic 2, right? So, yeah, and wow, fail. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, I don't really know what to say. Like, I don't know, like, this game is, like, I don't know, like, I had Sonic 3, that was my first game, and my cousin had this game, and then that's how I got into Sonic, because of those two, so, yeah. I mean, it's pretty, like, cool, like, it's a good game, I don't think it's my favorite of the three, though. Um, one thing... To know, I'm probably not gonna get all the Chaos Emeralds because I just am not good at the special stages here. And wow, I thought there was a checkpoint there. Sorry. So I'm just gonna go through the stages. If I if I find like a, a bonus thing, a checkpoint thing, and I have 50 rings, I'll jump in the ring. But I don't know if that'll really help because I don't know if I'll be able to um like get the. What am I trying to say? Like, I don't know. I'm not gonna be able to get the Chaos Island most likely because I suck at the special stages. But, okay. Um, gotta stop failing. That's number one. Number two. Yeah. Uh, this is Sonic 2. In my opinion, like, I know Sonic 3 was after it, but I think it's. I think, like, Sonic 3 is better. Not because it like improved on anything, but just cause that game seemed it was like my first game and it was more fun than this one to me. The only reason I like this one is cause you could play two players, like I mean you could play two players with the other one, but like my brother and me used to play this all the time with two players. So yeah. And here's Robotnik, the first boss. Not that hard. You just take he just takes a couple of hits. And then at the end, he'll just throw that thing out. And I always think, I don't know why, I always just spin dash, and then like, when he goes, he jump and try to hit him. I don't know, it's just something that, uh, when I was a little kid, I was like, yeah, I'm gonna destroy Robotnik so badly. <laughs> or something like that. I don't even know. Uh, wow, we already finished the first zone. That was pretty fast. This chemical plant. So this is my favorite. Well, actually, I have a couple of favorites in this game that are like zone-wise. I don't know. Like, this is usually like you're a kid that's like three years old. Are you really gonna get that far in a game? <laughs> Unless you're one of those really skilled people that are born pro or something like that. But I'm not. I was an average gamer. And I still am. I'm not gonna say I'm like the best. Because I'm not. I love the music here though. It's like one of the best. And if you see remixes of it, it's awesome. And this is like the stage where you can go really, 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 really fast and go outrun the camera and stuff like that. I keep saying like for some reason, I don't know. <laughs> wow. I remember I thought those were so cool because they were all 3D and stuff. I don't know. This little blue um snake things. And yay life. So the instruments in this kept the Sonic 1 feel, which I liked because I love the drums. And that's one thing about the Sonic 4 soundtrack. It was leaked, and I heard it, and I actually liked it because of the old, the old drums that they use and everything. Because, like, I don't know. I, I like Sonic 3's music, but not as much as Sonic 1 and 2 because of the fact that the drums weren't there. That just gave it the, that Sonic Genesis feel, these drums. I don't know why everyone hates, like, a lot of people I've seen, that I've talked to, uh, that know Sonic 4, and they know the soundtrack, they say it, they don't like it because of those drums. It doesn't sound too Sonic-like. But, 
in my opinion, that's that's a plus for it. I don't know if anyone else feels the same way, but that's my feel on it. I'm trying to let the music play, <laughs> so you guys could at least hear that. How fast we're going? It's like a roller coaster in this place. I think if you spin that, you actually go slower though. But it looks cooler to me. <laughs> like if you're rolling down a big hill in wall form, it's better than running down a big hill with just your feet going in a circle like that. Okay, well maybe not. Look at that. We just outran the camera. <laughs> That's how fast the zone. This is like the fastest zone of Sonic in the Genesis that I've ever seen. And if you jumped there, you could have gotten a shortcut. But apparently, uh, of course, I didn't. Alright, here's where I always died as a kid. I was panicked because it was the pink slash purple water of doom. <laughs> even though it's not even water, it's like chemicals. Or some crap. I don't know. And then I always got the drowning music. And then I was so scared, so I just said, uh, I'm gonna die. And <laughs> I just, like, died. <laughs> Alright, you could be lazy and wait, or you could do the spin dash way and just jump over it. Spin dash jump is just awesome. And for these platforms, wait until they all form back because you they can you will drop like you saw me doing like the first zone I think it was. Alright, here you can go as fast as you want because they actually are nice and stop you. Now you can do what you can wait again and I'll show you something that happened. Like they made sure that like down there there's a free life. I'll just say that. There's a platform and a free life, I think, if you go to the right. That's how much they, like, said, okay, we're not gonna make it- Whoa. Alright, I didn't know that was this falling platform. Alright. 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, that's- This is one of the easiest bosses. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, they Sega made this- This game, like, less harder than Sonic 1, in my opinion. Cause Sonic 1? was harder than this. I barely played Sonic 1 as a kid. It was this and Sonic 3 that I played the most. Of, I mean, Sonic-wise, of course. But, yeah. Aquatic Ruin already. Yeah, I'm not gonna do this like Sonic 3, obviously. Alright, these things will shoot arrows. You don't run really fast until you know that it's off the screen. Because even if it's off the screen, it'll still be able to hit you if you go fast enough to catch up to it. <laughs> because, unlike Mario, this is Sonic, it's Sonic 16-bit, which has more advancements, I should say. Uh, 37. Whatever. Uh, let's see if we can make it. Yeah. I, like, never take the top path. It's too hard for me to get. Oh, wow. That red guy makes me so bad. He's, he's, um, what's his name? My favorite Sonic TV show was so The Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog, and that's Grounder. That that guy reminds me of Grounder so much. Oh wow. Yeah, so this stage, um, it like has different paths. There's a mid path, a top path, and a bottom path, and a water bottom path thing. The bottom path obviously is gonna be. Wow, I almost drowned. The bottom path obviously is going to be water, while the middle is like near the water, but you're still on land and the top is mostly like the trees. But they did a good job with it. Like, if you take the top one, you'll finish way faster than you take the bottom, but it's not a bad thing. I mean, yeah. Wow, we're just going through this game so fast. I actually got this game on my iPod Touch, and yeah, I have one. Like, not long ago, because they released it. I don't know how much it costs, because I... Whoa, I lag. Stupid recording lag. <laughs> um, wow, I didn't know that shoots more than one. Because I'm a cheater, and I use install this because I have a jailbroken one. Sorry, Sega. But I really wanted Sonic 2. I already have a Genesis emulator on there, but... Oh wow, Sega emulates better than getting some stupid thing. 
Oh, no, it's my AVG stupid antivirus is gonna lag this. That sucks. And I keep getting hit. Stop grounder. I'm not gonna lose a life in this last play. I just jinxed myself, watch. Actually, after this zone, I think I'm gonna cut it. Because I know I'm gonna probably lag so much with this stupid antivirus thing. Alright. <laughs> Look at the trees, how they go. Oh man, I forgot those stupid mosquitoes are gonna hit you. How do they go underwater though? That makes no sense. They're flies. Alright, don't go 